mic. Push it to the max, kill him on the tracks. Give it to the end, got nothing left. I'ma shake the world. I'ma shake the world. I'ma shake the world. I'ma shake the world. Hi guys. Uh, Paul Ferrante again, Black Belt Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, in Spencerport, New York, at Peloton Martial Arts Center, uh, with my partner here, Nick Morabito, four stripe purple belt, and one of my assistant instructors here. Uh, the technique we're going to do today is a Tomonagi to spinning arm lock. Um, let's get started. So, guys, I like to enter this position usually by posting on the hips sometimes right from the spider guard. But what I'm doing is I'm trying to force my partner to really start posting either on my hips or on my stomach right along the belt line or actually even try to control my knees. As he does that, what I'm gonna do is get my grips and I'm gonna push my heels, my instep, right on his belt and I'm actually pushing him out, hoping that he'll actually step into me. As he steps into me, he's gonna automatically post on my chest. So as he does that, <laughs> I'm going to roll right into the mount position. Once I get to this position, guys, I'm going to fly right into my spinning arm on. And because the camera's on that side. <laughs> One more time, guys. So again, I can enter this position either from the butterfly, post on the hips, or I can go right for my closed guard. Preferably, this position is really nice. Like I said, post on the hips, start controlling the elbow. As I pull my partner forward, he's going to start posting, either on my chest or my hip line. Right into the mount. Once I get to the mount, guys, I'm going to control posture inside and outside. And that's a Tomonagi to spinning arm lock. Thanks, guys. Mike.